upside down. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one, action. Hi, welcome back to the VWD challenge. I hope you liked the outtake bloopers reel. We just wanted to do something different. So we do something different every week and I just wanted to mix it up a bit again this week with the thanks to Leah, my daughter. Uh, Leah, do you want to do the clapperboard one more time? Do yeah. the clapperboard one oh, more yeah. time. Oh yeah. So fun. Three, two, one, and we did get that. Where did we get that from? Um, Walt Disney Studios. Yeah, I think that was in France. Was it Paris? Disneyland Paris? I think it was yeah. in Disneyland Paris. Um, no, that was that. Yeah, that is. Disneyland yeah, Paris, is. wasn't it? Anyway, yes, I, I have a director today and she's been very good so far. Um, so, um, I'm going to start with my normal shout out. Just doing one this week, but I've got lots more to come. Uh, I'm going to do something slightly different this week as well. Um, Mads Hope, I will put a link in my bio to Mads Hope, she's a, a young lady, I think she's just starting out on her journey, or YouTube journey, and she's really, really good, uh, so I think she could do a little bit of support, so please check out her channel, there'll be a link in my bio. Um, also please subscribe to my channel if you can, uh, my channel as I say does have a lifespan till the end of November. Um, Obviously I work in the NHS so it's not something I can do on a permanent basis and I'd like to plough more time into my, my twins here. So I was tagged. I was tagged um, by um, Frankie's Disney Life and um, a Magic Kingdom tag. This is my first ever time I've done a tag. Uh, isn't it my first ever time I've done a tag? Yeah. Yeah, first ever time I've done... My first ever vlog with someone else in the background and she's been very well behaved down here so thank you. Okay, so, Magic Kingdom Tag. Uh, I've got Sleepy Hollow or Storybook Treats. Which one? I'm not Sleepy. sure. No, Storybook Treats, because I like sweets, though. Treats, not sweets. I know, they're the same. <laughs> they're the same. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's very funny. <laughs> sorry, Frankie's. Frank, um, sorry Frankie Disney Life, These, the, I'm, I'm getting all the help I can today. Um, my daughter says storybook treats because she thinks they're sweets. <laughs> so there you go. Okay, um, next one. Splash Mountain or Space Mountain? I think Splash Mountain because I like water. I'm, I'm, I'm saying, I'm saying Space Mountain. You saying, you saying Splash Mountain because you like water? No, I like, I like. Swimming, so. so you're gonna go Splash Mountain. Okay, we're gonna go. We're gonna, I'm my daughter saying Splash Mountain. I'm saying Space Mountain, and I say Space Mountain because that's where my challenge finishes. Where I'm hoping all my Instagrammers and maybe a few vloggers will be there when I come off the ride to say hello, uh, which would be good. Now I know the answer to this one before I even ask it: churros or popcorn? Churros. Really? Okay, why churros? I, I thought you would go for popcorn. Because they're pretzels. Oh, okay. So we're going. Okay. Except from you can't dunk them in cheese. You yeah. can't dunk them in cheese. Okay. Or custard. All right, fair enough. Well, that surprise me. Now we're going to have two varying opinions on this one. Okay. Mickey or Minnie? Mickey. No, Minnie. See, I'm going Mickey. And I have to go Mickey because it's just Mickey with a bow and without eyelashes. That's all it is. So you reckon Mickey is just Minnie without the bow and the eyelashes? And the dress. And the dress? <laughs> and the shoes! <laughs> okay, I'll, 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 look, she's chirping in here. She's 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 natural born vlogger. Okay, okay, now this one I think's easy done. Okay, Adventureland or Tomorrowland? That would have to be Adventureland because I'm more adventurous then. See, I'm going to say Tomorrow. Adventure. We've agreed on one. I say Adventureland. Because we're you go, more adventurous. Because you go Tomorrowland as you get to the castle and you go 
right and Adventureland I think is left at the castle in Disney World but we didn't get to do that much last time did we because we weren't that long in the park and no, we, we had to get out we had to get out quite quick we didn't even have that long for holiday did we yeah. like a tiny no so yeah so well, there we go then that's our that's that is uh Frankie's uh Frankie's Disney Life's tag done however I'm going to forward a tag but I'm going to forward a tag challenge style and i'm going to go get ready for my challenge style tag and i'm going to explain to you about that in a second so uh thank you uh frankie's disney life link in the bio please check out her channel um i'm going to forward the tag i'm going to forward the tag i might even forward it back to frankie because she gave this one to me and i'm going to pass a different one back and you have to see whether you can do better than me so uh, I'm just going to turn the camera off, get my stuff ready that I need to pass my tag back to someone in a slightly different way. And I think I know who I'm going to choose already. Mm. Who do you have to choose? Anyway, I'm going to okay. go and I'm going to go and get my stuff ready for my tag. As I said, I like to do things different on my channel. And um, let's see how it goes. Okay, bear with me. Welcome back. Um, right, we've got everything ready to do our tag. Um, so my tag involves two Disney, two of your favourite Disney items with a meaningful story behind them. Now this tag is designed to tell me a little bit more about the people that are following me because I like to know about people. And one personal item. So you've got two Disney items which you have a personal connection with and one personal item that you have a connection with. And you have to tell a short story about all three items. So I'm going to start off with a really nice one. And this is the Disney one. So I'm going to do one Disney, one personal, one Disney. Um, here goes. My first personal Disney item, and my mum is going to love this because this was given to me by my mum, is Sleeping Beauty. No, Snow White. Snow White. Snow White. I see you now I get it wrong. See, a good job I've got a director today, isn't it? Yeah, I forget sometimes. And she's from Hong Kong. And the beautiful thing is, is if you look at Sleeping Beauty, you've got... Snow White! Snow, Snow White. <laughs> you know, I'm not, editing, I'm not going to edit this out, am I? This is going to be one of the things. Um, I've got the seven dwarfs that go with them. All of them. And I'm going to put up a photo. Um after I finish talking about them. My mum is going to absolutely rave at this this one. Um, there they go, they're all there. Got to be really careful holding them all. They were holding me to help. That's okay, they're okay, they're all in there. They're they're, I've got them all, I've got all the figures. They were all collected from Japan. And it was given to me by my mum to look after. And I, I, I just absolutely love it to bits and this is the bit that I think all Disney guys are going to laugh at it's five dollars ninety five I mean I'm sure the equivalent of that in Disney nowadays is going to be what do you reckon forty five fifty dollars oh I think it'll be like a hundred dollars or something a hundred dollars like that. yeah and that's going to be pricey it's so I just love it and I think my mum broke one of the figures and um I think she waited five years for, for one of her friends to go back to Japan Disney. I think this is the story. I think she waited for one of her friends to go back to um, Japan and to buy, I think, which one was it? I think it was this one here, actually. I think it was uh, Bashful. I think Bashful had broken and my mum had couldn't complete the collection for five years and they were so rare to get hold of that... That's not Bashful. That's Bashful. It's not Bashful. I see. Bashful, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's bashful. Yeah, oh, they're bashful. So I think my mum had to wait till her friend went back five years later to finish off the collection. And it's my mum's most prized possession, and my mum gave it to me. And I just think that's really, really fantastic. And I don't know why I like it, but it's always wrapped up. I don't take it out of the wrapping very often, but I just thought I'd take it out to show you something on this vlog, which I hope once again it's something you've not seen because I like to keep this what I do fresh. So there we go. So that's my. One Disney, isn't it? One Disney? Yeah. Two to go? They're going to love the next one, aren't they? They're going to love the next one. So. Well, the other one. Okay. okay. So, personal. Say hello to 
Teddy Eddie. Um, he's 45 years old. Wow. Yeah, he's very old, isn't he? <laughs> wow, how he old? looks that young. And how old are you? Seven, eight. Eight, you were eight last week, weren't seven, you? Seven, eight last week. Oh, I forget and how old I am. Too old my most count. prized personal possession. Not so much the bear. Um, the funny thing is, this um, was knitted by my grandparents, who aren't here anymore. And I would never, ever lose it. My wife hates this with a passion. Um, even so, there's a tear in the leg. You can see a tear in the leg there. Can, I see? can you see the tear in the leg? And do you know who made that tear in the leg? The dog. The Heidi. Dog. Heidi made. Heidi <laughs> made. My old dog that I used to have made a tear and chewed her up one day, and I, and I got so upset. But ever since then, I think it's actually it shows you that you should never get angry about anything because now that tear reminds me of my dog, and um, he gets he gets locked away. He's 45. I think he'll probably make it to 100. Um, <laughs> But yeah, my most meaningful thing. Now, my wife hates this so much, doesn't she? Yeah, there's yeah. a really funny bit. Mummy hates this so much. And you even got a... I can't say it. Yeah, I can't say it, can you? No. So on our wedding day, my <laughs> wife um, hated it so much. And we would be me and my wife have a mental sense of humour. And we gave each other gifts. So for our gifts, I had my wife a mug made. <laughs> <laughs> why did, why she get you if she hates it. <laughs> I, I, why did I get it for mummy? Because it was just a joke we were doing. She hated it so much on our wedding day. I had a mug made with a picture of Monta. She could actually drink out of the mug and be close to the bear. Um, <laughs> also, what 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 mummy didn't realise was on our wedding day, he was actually I actually gone to see the priest the day before, and I'd actually had him sat up in the corner of the church where no <laughs> one could see him. And it was only afterwards that I told Mummy that actually the bear was actually in the church at the same time. <laughs> overlooking us. <laughs> That's good you are though, I don't you? Yeah. So yeah, my, oh, my most cherished possession and it tells you a little bit about me and my sense of humour and uh, how we get on. And it's, like I said, it's a very personal thing for me. Like I said, it can be a fun possession you show anyone. Like I said, two Disney things and one... Uh, two Disney things and one... Uh, personal thing. So there we go. What I'm going to do now is change my battery because my battery is flashing up. I'm going to change it and then I'm going to come back and do the final item. They're this literally going to love it, aren't they? They're going to love, love that. They're, they're love the story. So I'm going to just change my battery. Oh, no, bear with me. Love Sorry about that. Quick 30 second battery change there. Um, with the help of my, my, my director here. Doing a good job, aren't you? Yeah. 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 So um, the next, the third and final part of this tag is personal item. This. It's the partner statue. Can you see it if I get closer? There we go. I think they'll see that, won't they? Yeah. With the light. Yeah, they'll see that. Definitely. Um, the partner statue. So we, it was our first day in Disney and we were being attacked by love bugs, weren't we? It was a lo I love bug. I my feet. Yeah, there was a love bug <laughs> invasion, wasn't there? And we went into the Disney store and my son, uh, Luke, um, and what does Luke have? Luke has? Autism. Autism, doesn't he? And one of the things he loves is this. And we looked and looked in the shop and we couldn't find one anywhere. And um, we started talking to this lady and I had my Detroit Lions hat on. And she was from Detroit. And we said, do you have a partner statue? And she said, no, you, they, well, we've all sold out, but you know they are quite rare to get hold of now because there's not that many of them in the shop. And um, we also, uh, so she said, wait there a second. And she came back and he was getting quite upset by this point because he, he couldn't get hold of one. And you see, it's still got the tags on it there as well. And she cut off the price tag, and she and she gave it to us and handed it to us in a bag. And she and I said, "How much for that?" And she said, "That's on Mickey." And it made our entire trip to the park. I mean, these things are like twenty-five dollars, I think. And she handed it to us, and he goes, "This is this is a present from Mickey because she knew how badly and she understood about my child." So that is a big thing that Disney does, and. I just wanted to say thank you to the lady from Detroit who worked in the gift shop on Main Street, the Emporium, who did that for us because we were almost close to tears. But it now holds a really sentimental place in our heart, doesn't it? We love this. It's in our display yeah. cabinet downstairs. No one is allowed to touch it. No one's yeah. allowed to touch it. It's just such, it was just such an amazing thing. Uh, also, when we were getting our dad's pass, you got, what did you get? You got a... Well, I got a free bug. Yeah, you. Because he got a um, he got toy sword. lions. No, he, he got a sword, a sword, he and they gave you one. a bubble blower at guest services, didn't they? Yeah, he lost his bubble. 
Um, he lost his sword, didn't sword. he? Yeah, I know, he lost his sword. So there we go. That is two really personal things from Disney. My, my prize products from Disney. And they, they've got a stories behind it. But I think this, that's the most fantastic story from Disney and, and the magic of Disney. And I think right now, it will, I know all everyone's a bit, they want to get back there. But when it's safe, uh, yeah, I hope you like those stories. Um, I think... Uh, I think the bear one's funny, don't you? Mummy never knew the bear was in the church. Right? <laughs> yeah. I thought that was I've never funny. seen that have Yeah, I thought that, that was quite be... funny. Oh, I'm going to so, do that on my wedding. So, we're going to put links to the next people in my bio. And I'm going to go on later on, do my editing, and then I'm going to send them the text to say that they've been tagged. Now, director, it's your time to shine. Should we say who we're going to forward yeah, 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 yeah. this tag onto? Okay. Um, which one is it then? All four of them. Okay. Okay, we'll call them out. So I start from the top? Start from the top. Okay. Jen and Joe on the go. So Jen and Joe on the go, you've been tagged in this tag. Jess Mock. Jess Mock. You've been tagged in this tag. Flat Fam. Flat Fam. Bring it on. <laughs> anyway, next one. Frankie Disney Life. And Frankie, who tagged me, is going to get a tag returned. Um... There we go. That's it for this week. Um, hope you've enjoyed this. Hope. Uh, thank you to my director. Thank you, director. Thank you. You're very good. You're very funny. You're very yeah. funny. Yeah. Um, and so you've got two personal Disney products that mean a lot to you with a story and one personal product that means a lot to you with a story. It can be a fun story. It doesn't have to be sad like uh, my bear. It's a fun story. I hope you like it. Um, I'm going to do a pop-up vlog this week, which I'm going to film later on today. Because uh, I'm going to go down and have something to eat now and edit this all together on my laptop. And I shall see you guys next week. Thank you. Please subscribe to my channel. Um, it's, do you want to tell them to... You, you tell them. Sadly, I won't be there when we're doing the pop-up vlog. Are you won't, Yes, yeah. sadly. She's not going to be here when I do my pop-up vlog. But you can tell them to subscribe for me. Tell! Subscribe! That sort of, yeah. I think she's getting the hang of it. I think she's a better vlogger than I am. I'll see you guys next week. Hope you enjoyed this next week. Um, I'm going to enjoy staying tuned to watch those people that I'm tagging today. I think they like the, um, the bloopers, didn't they? Oh, do you think they like the bloopers oh, yeah. at the beginning? The bloopers were good, weren't they? <laughs> yeah. yeah, old school Disney. We like it. So, see you guys next week. Thanks for watching this week. Take care. I need my soul to scream out.